Hey boys and girls, it's Miss Carol with another story. Today, I'm going to talk to you about the zoo. How many of you have been to the zoo? We have a wonderful zoo here in Columbia. It's called the Riverbank Zoo. There are all kinds of animals there, and I just love to go look at them. I wonder what your favorite animal is. Hmm. Oh, it's hard for me to decide. You know, when I was growing up, I always wanted to work at the zoo. You know, feeding the animals. Well, today, I'm going to tell you a story that takes place. The setting is the zoo. And the story I'm going to read you is called Good Night, Gorilla. And it is by Peggy Rathman. So let's see what happens in this book. Good Night Gorilla. Good Night Gorilla by Peggy Rathman. Good Night Gorilla. Hmm. You see what's happening there? Mm hmm. Cheeky little gorilla. Oh dear. The night watchman. Security guard doesn't seem to know what's happening. Good night, elephant. Hmm, what's that gorilla thinking? Good night, lion. Good night, hyena. Good night, giraffe. <laughs> Good night, armadillo. Oh, looks like they're following him. <laughs> to the house. Into the bedroom. That gorilla's tired. <laughs> oh, good night, dear. Good night. 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 <laughs> she woke up wondering who all those voices were. <gasps> oh my goodness. I wonder what she thought when she saw all those animals in her bedroom. Well, she's leading them back to the zoo. Good night, zoo. Ah, oh, good night, dear. Good night. <laughs> Good night, Gorilla. The end. <laughs> oh, that was so fun. That Gorilla let all the animals out of their cages and they followed the zookeeper or the security guard to his house. <laughs> oh, well, I hope you enjoyed this story. And I hope you get a chance to go to the zoo soon. It's so much fun to go see all those animals. But don't be letting any of them out of their cages. Well, we'll see you next time on Storytime with Miss Carol. Bye.